Welcome. In this video, I'll show you how to app clone in Samsung. All right. If you find this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more such tutorials. Now, first up, go ahead and locate the settings app. And here, just tap on it, okay, to open it up. Now, once it's open, go ahead and scroll down until you find the section advanced features, okay? Tap on it. Now, in here, go ahead and find dual messenger. This one, just tap on it. Now, as you can see here, we have these available apps. As you can see, I only have four, but yours might be different. You might be able to see multiple apps right here that is supported, okay? Now, what you'll do, for example, you want to do a uh, copy messenger or have two messenger apps and uh, logged in with two separate accounts. You can go ahead and turn on messenger right here. Click on install. Okay, there will be disclaimer. Just hit on confirm and uh, turn this on right here. Use separate contacts. Okay, if you want to, you can go ahead and select the contacts from here. If not, you can just go ahead and close it. And it says here turning on dual messenger. Just wait for it. It says here it is done installing. So what we're going to do is just find it. Okay, I have my messenger in here. This one and the second one is right here with this orange icon. Okay, when I tap on it, it's going to open up and it will require you to sign in. All right, as you can see here, here we have the logo as well with the orange one. Okay, that means that you're currently using the uh, duplicate messenger. Right here, just go ahead and sign in, and once done, you'll have two separate Messenger app and accounts. If you're using a more advanced or more up-to-date phone or newer model phones, you can go ahead and use the feature uh, Samsung Secure Folder. Okay, you can go ahead and find that under the e Settings app as well, Secure Folder. You're just going to want to go to uh, Settings, um, Settings right here. And then go to a security. Okay, security right here. And go ahead and find more security settings or other security settings. Tap on it. Now in here you should be able to find a secure folder. If you do have that, you can go ahead and set it up the same as what we have done earlier. It's pretty easy. Okay, that's basically how you do it. Well, I hope this video helps and uh, I'll see you in the next one.